Sunday, 5th of July 2022, there was a great panic in Ondo State and the entire country as a known gunman attacked the St. Francis Catholic Church in Owo, Ondo State. The aftermath of the unimaginable incident of Sunday, 5th of July 2022, at the St. Francis Catholic Church in Owo, Ondo State, remains a bitter pill to swallow as the assailants killed scores of innocent worshippers who were gathered to mark the holiday of Pentecost and left scores injured with death toll rising to 40. In recent developments, groups and well many Nigerians have been gone donating to the victims of the massacre. As typical of the Ogundaris Foundation, a non-profit organization brought to life out of compassion to help the less privileged by being a haven away from home, creating shelter and putting smiles on the faces of everyone as embarked on this special project to ease the burdens of victims of the massacre. The project tagged back to school is aimed at sponsoring the education of children of the victims who lost their lives in the massacre. The project lead of back to school project, which is fully sponsored by the Ogunda Race Foundation, in respect to what happened on June 5 in our war on those states, the massacre that happened in church here. So the Ogunda Race Foundation has seen this need to hear the call of the people, most especially the children, to take them back to school. No matter the class they had, the foundation is ready to fully sponsor their education from now, from the class they are now to the completion of their tertiary education. And yes, this is what we do in Ogunda Race Foundation. We bet success, leaving no one behind. You know, the pain of the community is actually our own focus. We turn their pain into laughter. And that is why we are here in the All Over of Our Kingdom to let him know, to create his awareness about this project. And we sympathize with the people of our world. They will never, this will never happen in Yoruba land again in Nigeria. In a condolence visit to the Olowo of Owo, the founder of the foundation, fully represented by the Back to School Project team lead, Ms. Ayomide Akintade. A forerunner in this course sympathized with the king and the peace-loving people of Owo and also gave a foresight on the planned project. Firstly, sir, I say happy, sister. Sir. Yes, sir. So on behalf of the Ogunda Race Foundation, sir, we send our condolences to the great people of our kingdom that such will not happen again, sir. And the, from the foundation, sir, I want to embark on a project titled Back to School Project, whereby the children of the affected um, victims will be taken back to school from any class they have till the completion of their tertiary education, fully sponsored by the Ogunda Race Foundation. So we were at um, the church this morning to ask for the compilation and we were told by next week we would get it. So we are here to preach our awareness sir, that we are doing this project in this community that you, sir, Kabisi, should please give us the go ahead. The back to, to school, take school project back is to aimed at ensuring that the children of the affected victims go back to school from any class they are in currently to the completion of that tertiary education. This will be fully sponsored and funded by the Ogundaris Foundation, she revealed. Receiving members of the foundation, the Olowo of Owadi, Gladigeshi Ogwedi III, appreciated the foundation for their condolence visit and for also introducing a laudable project. Mm, so, Ogundari Foundation, uh, thank you for coming to commiserate with us. What happened on Sunday, the fifth? You have heard you, and that is the desire of the foundation to bring the, the children of the deceased uh, back to school. Um, and you have done, you have done well because uh, what has happened. Cannot be reverted, we must move ahead with life. And uh, the most important thing uh, in the lives of uh, 
the children of the Zist, or those who are who have been injured beyond uh, being able to cope with the vicissitudes of life, is to stretch out uh, an helping hand so that those children could go back to school. I think the best way to to develop society is to educate the younger ones. Uh, education is key. It is uh, most important if any society is to is to continue to live in peace and harmony. If those who perpetrated the act have been well educated, they will know the fact that uh, such cannot be undertaken by them. Project. The Olawo further appreciated the founder, Mr. Oluwashe Gabriel Ogundari, for giving its feet to bring the children back to school. I thank you for creating a right direction for the foundation. Your foundation is unique because it is aimed at developing thank you society. For, for this effort and uh, the, the brain behind the foundation, whenever I surrender, you have said. Uh, be ready to, to meet him and to thank him profusely for his wondrous efforts and uh, bring him back those to those uh, children bring them back to school. Uh, I thank you very much, uh, all of you, for, for creating the right direction for for the foundation because there are foundations whose uh, Philosophy might not necessarily lead to the development of an individual or the society at large. So yours is unique. Because if the society is educated, if the society is educated, then such uh, harbor will never happen. Because the, those, everybody will have been will be well educated have for good information, uh, have uh, the, 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 the piety to do good rather than to cause our work. Uh, thank you. I uh, appreciate you and I appreciate all, all the other members of the, of, the, of the group that are here. And also I thank Dulu uh, now for, for, for the contact so that uh, we can have this interface. So I thank you for coming. In the meantime, the Olunau of Unau in Owo, Oba Olunarewaju Abegunde, lauded the Ogundaris Foundation for such an initiative in a time like this. He further prayed for the community, even as he hoped that the culprits are brought to book. The Ogundari Foundation is geared toward ensuring that in our quest to ensure a safe haven for our children, we leave none behind, irrespective of the circumstances. Mm -hmm.